Appalachian Wireless proudly brings you unlimited data. Unlimited data is only $80 a month for a single line. Four lines as low as $200. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. An East Kentucky network company. Data speed slow to 25 gigabytes per line to 512 kilobits for phones and tablets and 15 gigabytes for modems. See store for more details. A new book by Pike County historian David Deskins called Ginseng, Coal Dust, Moving Mountains, A History of Pike County, is now available to the public. Deskins says he was asked in 2015 to redo a Pike County history book he originally wrote in 1994, but he says three years later, this new book has an identity of its own. It's completely new, much, much, much new material stuff I've come across. I may have de developed a different perspective in the last 30 years uh, on some things. Deskins takes a comprehensive look at Pike County from the Native Americans who first lived here to some little known facts about the role Pike County played in the Civil War. Many, many, many things happened. Intrigue, spies, assassinations, political figures, murder, you know, and some, some fighting. Uh, you know, Pike County probably started out pro-Confederate, ended up pro-Union. Readers will also find out how many who settled here in Pike County prior to the launch of the coal industry made their living. Uh, we were part of what you call the uh, hardwood capital of the world. Uh, uh, folks cutting logs, on the, cutting timber on the uh, Vice Fork of the River and, and floating them out to uh, Catlisburg and they went everywhere. Uh, there are a lot of houses built in uh, New Orleans right now that are made out of Pike County timber and still standing there. David Deskins will attend his first book signing on Saturday, February 24th at the Book Notes Bookstore in Pikeville, where copies will be available. In Pikeville, I'm Shannon Deskins, EKB News.